guys, this is what your room will look like when you first move in. So, obviously you're gonna have two beds, two dressers, two desks, and two closets. This room just so happens to come with two windows. Not all of them have them, but this is definitely a gym. Now that you know what comes into your room, I'm gonna give you a few things that I think you should add. To start off, we're gonna start with a steamer. I love my steamer, that way I can iron out any wrinkles that I may have without having to like get a big bulky iron and an ironing board. Um, it's super compact and I definitely think you should add that to your list. Um, a bonus to the things that I love to bring to my room is an ottoman. Not only can you use this to step up onto your bed because it is super high, at least for me. You can also use it as storage. So. I love to put my shoes in here, any type of purses, anything like that, definitely add that inside the oven. Another thing that I love to bring is a lap desk. So there's going to be times where you're going to be sitting at your desk, where you get super tired, but you still want to crank out some work. So you can hop into your bed, get one of these desks, and still do any homework that you may have. Another thing is an extra extra long power cord. This is something that you can use if you decide to loft your bed. Um, you can actually like get to your power cord if you make it any higher or if you just like want to have something to be able to extend across the room. I highly recommend getting one of these. Some other cool things that I highly recommend adding to your room is this organizer. You can add your wallet, your keys, your phone, your Apple Watch, anything you can think of right here next to your bed and you don't have to worry about losing it. We have our fan. I highly recommend getting a fan. Not only can you use it as background noise, but if you and your roommate like the room at a different temperature, you can always use a fan for yourself if you like it a little bit colder. Another bonus that I like to add is this bed lamp. So if you're reading and your roommate is going to bed and you don't want to disturb her, you can use one of these to be able to continue studying along with that lap desk that I mentioned earlier. And it's just a great addition to have. Now, this next thing is a mammoth of a blanket. I highly recommend getting you a weighted blanket. I cannot do without mine. It's definitely kind of heavy to get inside your dorm room, but it's a great addition to be able to get that good night's sleep. I'm really into making smoothies these days. It's a great way to get an extra boost of vitamins, so please try to invest in a blender. Our next set of essentials you're gonna be wearing a bunch of different clothes, whether that's t-shirts, dresses, suits, anything you can think of. So you're gonna need a hamper to be able to sort out your clothes. Um, I highly recommend getting a sturdy one, that way you can, even one with wheels on it, that way you can just wheel it down to the laundry room. Um, so definitely invest in that. And the final thing that I do wanna point out is get you a shower caddy. This one's super sturdy and it has different compartments for you to put your toothbrush, toothpaste, um, bar soap, anything you can think of. And since we're talking about the shower caddy, we should definitely take a look inside of, inside of the bathroom. So. So, just picture it. You're getting ready for your class in the morning and you just so happen to be brushing your teeth and next thing you know someone walks in, may even become your best friend. These are the community style bathrooms. <laughs>